Hello gents and ladies, um, I'm now uh, busy with part 2 of my hydraulic system and I'm very pleased to see something today. You see this, uh, this one, the one at the far left, go to this uh, shaft all the way and then you can see there it stopped there at that point and I always always thought that must go to the choke and I thought it's a, it's a loose piece but now that I focus on the hydraulics I've realized that it is attached let me just see I don't know if you can see but it's attached there to to a bracket or a part that go into the pump or uh, whatever area there so that is good so if I move this one it will it will operate that's fine and then the other one this one that I moved yesterday so I'm gonna put in some more oil I've got another liter and then uh, check if this two uh, arms move and then I just want to check that valve that might be stuck and this must be the only valve that is here is this one I believe I will uh, tap that with a hammer if uh, it, it is stuck ok gents let me throw in the oil and then we will see I just want to get a, fun, a funnel for the other one. Okay, James, I'm finished. The other bottle had uh, that uh, piece in front, which make it easier. So there's now one liter more in. Just get the tractor ready. Okay, gents, let's try that trick of the start again. The auto ignition. Ignition.
Take it to the other side. Try if we can see both. Want to work it a little bit. Okay. I hope I uh, point the camera so that you can see what's going on. Um, what is strange is. Uh, it seems if the other one moves as well, a little bit, then I move this lever, both of them, see that, on the other side it moved, but on this side as well, so I'm not sure if that is correct. Okay, this is now interesting. Uh, you can hear the pump now. Can you hear that? I believe it's normal. Maybe you can tell me what is the best position to leave it on the center or at the bottom there. Okay, let me stop it. Okay, gents, this gives you an idea how it works currently. That spill there is me with the first bottle. I don't see any other leaks whatsoever out of this system which is good I hope this video come out nice because uh, it was uh, sort of a, a difficult one ok gents let me first think a little bit if there's more I can say 
Okay, gents, uh, I think that is more or less what I can do for now. I'm going to upload this video and then uh, you can give me your advice or your uh, comments on how the system works. Maybe it's 100%, it's supposed to work like that, or maybe some tuning, whatever. But in any case, thanks for watching. I'm so very surprised that everything is still working, um, just by adding uh, about 2 liters of oil by now. Okay, thank you very much.